situation in Bahrain is really getting worse and worse day by day. Um, the attack against human rights defender is becoming more. Um, today, as I was shocked to hear the sentence against uh, Zainab al-Khawaja was to three years, and she's still waiting on other cases, which might be much more. Um, it means that they're continuing uh, all these, um, I mean, strip, uh, deciding to silence all the activists. Anybody who, who talks will be behind bars or he will be targeted, especially what happened to Nabil. He was arrested for two years for a tweet. And again, after he was released, he again, he wrote a tweet and he was again arrested for one month. And now we're waiting for the verdict in the beginning of next year or in the 20th actually of January. And he might be facing another couple of years. Um, not to forget Mariam al Khawaja, who was uh, sentenced to one year, but it, she's lucky that she is out of Bahrain. And she was again sentenced for one year. Um, the situation is getting worse and worse for human rights defender. Um, they're always facing danger. I mean, who speaks in Bahrain will be targeted. Um, especially Nabil Rajab is very influential uh, person in Bahrain and they want to silence him. I, I, we are very much worried that he might be behind bars again. Uh, there was a little bit of pressure, but it's never enough because, you know, we are in Bahrain, we're victims of our location. Uh, we are located nearby Saudi Arabia and the interest of that location makes uh, the decision and in interfering in Bahrain is different than other areas. There was some uh, good uh, remarks, especially from the EU calling for uh, the release of Nabil, but it's never enough. We need something. We need the other countries to stop arming Bahrain because everybody knows that they are using these arms to uh, target the citizens or target the uh, protesters. Uh, everybody knows that they use the technology which they bring from the EU to target the activists. So we need support. We need them to be um, to put Bahrain and make Bahrain responsible for what they are promising. The Bahrain is a, the best country for, um, I mean, when it comes to recommendation, they're the best country. They will accept all the recommendations and they will say that they will do reform, they will improve the, the situation, but it's getting worse and worse day by day. We need um, the support and the help from the West to put, make Bahrain responsible for their words and to respect the human rights situation and stop the violation.